What is going on here guys? It is me again. And today I'm back with a gym video. Well, training video, okay? This is for anyone that does boxing, okay? Or tennis, or any of those kind of sports. Golf as well, okay? It's to focus on your lats, okay? Women can use it as well, okay? If, um, for summer, if you want to look thinner. You just do this and it's going to make you look thinner, okay? Because it's going to widen out the rest of your body, okay? Now, it's got an upright row, okay? If you know what that is, that's great. But do you know how to do it right, okay? So you get your weight. Now, to do it right, okay? Get rid of your fucking ego. First thing, get rid of it, okay? Do not do this with heavy weights unless... You've worked from the bottom up, from light to heavy, okay? So then you're able to keep your form throughout. Because if you lose your form in this, you're going to be hitting your back and almost like your obliques in a way, rather than your lats. Because say if you're a boxer and you throw a punch, it's your lats that are engaged. If you play golf, it's your lats. Same with tennis, it's your lats as well, along with your shoulder, okay? So, if you want to have a stronger punch or a harder hit in golf and in tennis, you do this. Okay, you hold the weight down like this, make sure the rest of your body is, you know, stable. Okay, and you just bring it up like this. Okay, now I don't want to see your elbow going out wide like this, or I don't want to see it turning like this. Okay, keep it nice and easy, slow, okay, bring it up. Make sure your elbow goes past your back, okay? So you're trying to push that elbow past your back every time, okay? Now, I'm using like 11 kgs for that. It's, it's handy, okay? Now, that's just for a demonstration. If you want, you can go heavier if you're able for it, okay? Just do that, okay? In your gym session, if you're good training your back or your shoulders, just make sure you're just doing that as well, okay? Even in the boxing training and stuff like that, they'd get you to do things like this, okay? Where you'd be doing push-ups, but as you're pushing up, you go one handed and you take a weight off the ground and you pull it back down, go down for a second rep, up, lift it up on this side, and down. So you're working on your chest, your shoulders, and your lats in one movement, okay? which is really good and uh, that's that's pretty much it okay so if you guys like this exercise I personally love it okay but I don't really use it a lot as you can clearly see because I don't got bulging lats <laughs> but um, that's where a lot of boxers power comes from if you look at any of the professional boxers okay if they're even going to do a pull up or something like that okay you'll see their ribs and then you'll see this massive just lump coming out the side of them. That's their lats. All right. They run all the way down your back. Okay. Around the back of your ribs. Okay. That's where all the power comes from. There in the shoulder. Mostly the lats. Okay. If anyone tells you it's something else, they're telling shit. Okay. If you want to get stronger, even if you're doing any other kind of sports that involve those arms, really. You know, now I don't mean like snooker, because <laughs> snooker doesn't involve it, but anything else really, it works on it, it does really well, okay? So I want you guys to do, uh, we'll go with 10 reps, okay? 10 reps, 3 times, okay? With the weight that's manageable. I don't want you going in with like 100 kgs and just going fucking mad. And then again though, I don't want you going in with like 2 kgs. And going fucking as if you're trying to fucking punch the air with it. No. I don't want you doing that. I want you to get in a weight that's manageable. That's a fairly difficult but not like to a point where you're like this. Ah! Alright? You're not like that, okay? You're keeping it nice and controlled, okay? And after the three sets of ten reps, 